if I was going to do a problem like this, here I have the cube root of 16x to the fifth. And again, the main important thing, if you can't think of your square numbers or a number raised to the third power, again, use the factor tree. Here you have 4 times 4, 2 times 2, 2 times 2. It takes a little while, but you can do every single problem by using the factor tree. Um, cube root of 2 times 2 times 2 times 2. Mr. Yes. That is absolutely a perfect thing. That's exactly what I would definitely do. Um, but I'm just showing students just the way that it works from here. Yeah, ab actually. So absolutely, since you know that now that's a cube number, you can just absolutely rewrite it as 8 times 2. And that is actually my preferred method of doing it. Um, because 8 is a cube number. Why do you know 8 is a cube number? Because we just showed 8. You can take the cube root of 8. 8 is 2 times 2 times 2. The next cube number for 3 would be 27. 3 times 3 times 3. So anytime you can use those numbers, you can. And yes, I prefer that. But I know a lot of students um, are just going through. I just want to make sure we can always rely on factor. Are always, you can always rely on factoring out a number. But yeah, that is the preferred and quickest way. And the same thing. I'm not going to rewrite x to the fifth power, ladies and gentlemen, um, out x times x times x. You could. But again, the same thing. Yeah, you can write it x times x times x times x times x. But once you guys notice, it kind of takes a little bit, right? So the other way to do it is you, you can only take the cube root of x to the what power? Third power. So if I write this as x to the third power, what do I need to multiply x to the third power to make it to be x to the fifth? x squared. So as I mentioned, there's kind of two different ways. You can do the factorization, or you can also use the product rule. So now I take out my groups of three. Or I say I can take the cube root of 8 and I can take the cube root of x cubed. So therefore, this pulls out to give me um, 2 times x times the cube root of 2x squared. Right? The cube root of 8 is 2. Cube root of x cubed is x. And then 2x squared is left in between. Or you take out the 2, take out the x, and you're left with 2x squared. Does everybody see that? Anybody have any questions?